I was just listening to the Gospel of Matthew. I tend to listen to it more than I tend to read it. Um, Because when I read it, I don't really get the same effect as when I listen to it. And when Jesus was speaking, he got to the part where he said, And all will see the Son of Man coming on the clouds of heaven with great glory, with all the holy angels. And when he had spoke those words, I kind of went out of, like, a lot of people would say it's almost like going into the Spirit. And um, I hadn't prayed for any kind of vision or anything, but I I kind of came out of the whatever you want to call it. I went into the spirit and all of a sudden I saw coming upwards down. I, I, I looked around and I wasn't in my room. I was like almost like in a field of like grass or whatever. And I looked upwards and I saw Jesus, but a, a ton of light. Like I could barely tell it was him because it was so much light. And I saw him coming down, but he looked like he was on a horse, but he was on top of a cloud. Like, a horse on top of a cloud with a ton of light coming off of him. I couldn't tell any features because there was way too much light, but around him I saw tons and tons of angels, hundreds, all coming down. And it was kind of like a movie scene because that was the first kind of part of my vision that I saw. I saw Jesus on a cloud on a horse and I saw all kinds of angels coming down. Now, if you don't believe me here, you're not going to believe any more than this, but if you do, I'll continue. So I had seen that, but then it transferred over almost like a dream does, and I was wide awake when this happened, just to remind you. And it switched from seeing Jesus coming downward to a different scene where I saw people running away from him. They were running in fear, they were screaming, they were totally afraid, but I saw a few of them getting, like, burnt to ashes, and when they kind of went into ashes, I saw another scene of people raising up, like, kind of flying upwards, glowing and whatnot. Now, this is, this happened really fast, so it's kind of hard to explain it, but I saw people with uh, radiant glowing all around, and I I actually saw them going upwards into like some form of light. Now, they were alive when it happened. Now, I know it says that there's going to be a resurrection of the dead, but they were alive. Now, this reminds me of when Christ said, whoever lives and believes in me shall never die. So, kind of makes me think, well, if you're alive when that, at that time, you're just going to go upwards or, or be resurrected from your old body? I'm not going, I'm not completely sure, but basically, um, right after I had seen people levitating upwards, I looked down at myself, and I actually had seen myself coming up off the ground, and I saw glowing, like, around my arms and legs and everything. It was, it was kind of, I don't know, it was kind of crazy, but Again, I just kept seeing more people running from all the angels and Christ and all that stuff, but they were in terrible fear. Now, there were some people rising upward, some people running in fear, but I saw myself rising upward into the light that everyone else was rising up into. So, I'm not completely sure what to make of it, but the the last part kind of made me question a bit more, because when I had come out of it, I I was I still felt weird, but I heard a voice, and it said, "Preach these things, for the time is now at hand." And I had asked in my head, "What do you mean now at hand?" And it said, "Preach to whoever has an ear to hear, for the time is now at hand." And I was kind of confused, and I'm saying it as exactly as it uh, happened. So, kind of short, but like. I don't know quite what to make of it. Maybe you will you will know what to make of all that. I don't quite know, but maybe you will. But anyway, um, if, if you want to get one thing out of this, it's that this stuff is going to happen, and it's going to happen pretty dang soon. So I would be ready, but I, I'll just... I don't know. I'll just have to keep watch on this stuff because... Um, like I said in the beginning, I had never gotten a vision like this, and I know it's kind of short, but, like, it happened really fast, so, um, well, take that as you will, and, uh, hopefully you will have the strength to repent 
and do whatever you need to do to get closer to Christ.